Welcome back to another episode of Your Daily Real Estate. I'm Tristan. This episode is brought to you by my coaching, a brilliant tribe.com. Not only do we do coaching, we have a whole marketing agency. We have a community growth arm to this. We've got a lot there. So if you are curious, go to a brilliant tribe.com. Thank you for listening to this podcast. This podcast is meant to be up about five minutes, sometimes a little longer, sometimes a little shorter, meant to motivate you and keep you moving in the right direction, sometimes with actionable steps, sometimes with just words. And today, we're going with words because uh, I, I created a Facebook group called Lab Code Agents in 2014, and I've seen... I've seen it grow and I've seen a lot of different types of agents come in and help others come in and complain. Others come in and just, just look. And right now in the atmosphere that we have with the NAR settlement coming up, uh, where August 17th is the date where we have to have all of these contracts all set to go. And then November 26th, as of right now is a date that court approval is given and this becomes final there's a lot in the air right now and a lot of that is challenging for real estate agents and i want to remind you that right now this is the way that the challenge looks next year the challenge will look different the following year the challenge will be something else four years ago the challenge was COVID. we're always going to be challenged we must adjust to always living in a world of uncertainty. I want you to focus on the opportunity. I want you to focus on whatever happens next. You will adjust. You will adapt. This is what humans do, but they also complain while adapting. I've noticed, but you, you listening, you are different. Here's the opportunity that you have while everyone is telling you the world is going to change around you. No more this, no more that. Oh my gosh, contracts. It's so complicated. What are we going to do? The fact is we don't know exactly what's going to happen, but was that different from yesterday where we didn't even know if we were going to wake up alive today, if today was our last day. You have the opportunity to create what's next in this next world of real estate. For me, I'm excited to see how we figure this out as an industry. What does it look like to work with a buyer a year from now? What becomes customary? I don't know, but I know I'm going to be part of this. I want you to take a look at this with more curiosity. Because when you look at things with a curious mind, you start thinking of possibilities and you push away the victim mentality. So today, as you're looking and thinking and seeing and reading and just being part of real estate in 2024, August, I want you to see the opportunity. I want you to think about the opportunity. I want you to feel that there is change and the change is good. Because at the end of the day, it does come back to you. What do you do with the current situation? What do you do with what you can control? Focus on that. And we'll talk again tomorrow.